My coach, John and I are firm believers in what's done in the winter will show up in the summer. That's really helped me be the athlete that I am today and, and contributed to my success. It's all about getting to the start line, making sure that I get there and I'm fit, physically, mentally, injury free, and obviously fast for Tokyo. I was born here. I mean, not on the track. <laughs> that would be pretty awkward, wouldn't it? I was born in Bromley. I lived in Bromley, went to school in Bromley. My friends are from down here. And I absolutely love it here. Hello. It's like a second home to me. I've been coming to the same track since I was eight years old. I've grown up with many of these people. I think I'm aware that I'm a role model to them because people tell me, but I don't feel any different to any of them. Being here, training within my community, with my friends, I just think is the best way to stay happy, and a happy Dina is a fast Dina. When the gun goes off, I think nothing and everything at the same time. Just a relaxed state of calm, just then. Well, yeah, training's hard, but you get out what you put in, and you've got to be consistent. So that means training in the light, in the dark, in the rain, or if it snows, you just got to make sure that you put the work in. Every day is different, and this time of year, typically, it's lots of speed endurance, lots of high intensity runs. I train six days a week. The one day that I'm not training, I am sleeping, and then <laughs> eat, chill, sleep, do it all again. We all work really hard. We have fun at training, but my coach doesn't let us have it easy, so. <laughs> Like many elite sprinters, I've had injuries before. And yeah, it's not fun. When you're injured, I think the most important thing is to always focus on your end goal. I want to be the best athlete that I can be. I mean, when I first started, I didn't imagine that I'll become world champion. But ultimately, it's just about the moment. And it's just about expressing myself and putting all the hard work that I've done that year and over the years into those 11 or 21, 22 seconds that I'm going to be running for. I only focus on myself. And the reason I love track and field is because it's about doing your personal best. I'm really happy, obviously, to be world champion. Like, it's a dream that I've always had. But I'm so focused on just being better than I was last year. I've been, like, every day thinking about it. And I have to keep pushing boundaries. I have to keep working harder. I want to go into summer and be as fast as I can be.